To create folders in BIM 360 document management, simply go to your file tab on the left hand side, either under plans or project files. In this case, we're going to try project files. Hit the three dots at the end of project files, add subfolder and name it accordingly. So this can be, you can name it after different disciplinary teams that you may be using within the project, or you can name it after the different companies if you prefer. So I'm just going to call this architecture, structural, and MEP. So this is where we'll allow each of those teams to see to save their different files. So for example, if I go into architecture, I can set different permission levels that I only allow the architectural members into that particular folder. So I just hit the three dots again, go to permissions, and I can select which individuals I want. So as I'm the particular admin user, I have full access on this folder. If I go to add, I can add any sort of uh, other people, either by email address, email address that person will then receive an email uh, to say you've been invited to the project and I can set their particular permission level so I can just give them view only access if I wish they'll now receive an email to say that you've been invited to this particular project and they'll have to accept it and the same for the MEP folder go to permissions I'm going to add my colleague Paul Hewitt onto this particular one add And you can see he hasn't come up. And the reason for that is, is because he hasn't been added to the particular project yet. So what I'm gonna do, I'm just gonna add the different roles that are allowed within this particular project. So we can add the plumbing engineer to this particular folder. So anyone with the designation or role of plumbing engineer, if it happens to be Paul Hewitt, he can then be assigned the permissions for the MEP folder only. That means that he can't access uh, the architectural folder unless you give that person particular permissions. You can set their I'm going to give them a uh, view, download, and upload permissions to the MEP folder as well. I'm just going to add him. And I can see and control all of the different uh, access rights here in the right hand side just by clicking on permissions at each folder level, permissions. If I set permissions at the project files level, if I go to permissions, anybody that I give access here will automatically have access to anybody below in the hierarchy, if you think of it that way as well. Thank you.